Hey guys, for this one, your reactors come preset. So just cl double click on your first standard reactor. Then you start off the red line, which goes left, and you've got a whole lot of flip flops facing left and then one facing up. And then they sort of go around, all the way around, and then back. And then you've also got um, arrows pointing down. So you just do that. Then this flip flop goes up and right and down and left to your grab job. And you've got your bonders here. And then you've got a fork out and an A, a grab, and down and right to a negative bond, and down to a grab drop. Then left to a circle out, then left to a sink, then up to a grab drop, then right to a sink, then left for your negative bond, and around to your grab drop, and it just goes around like that. For your blue line, you go left to a sink, then up to a grab drop, then up to a fork out, then right to a grab drop, then down to an out fork, then down to a sink, and then back into start. For your top reactor, you go for the blue line and you go left to sink, then left to NB, then left to positive bond, left for your grab drop to a counterclockwise rotation, and you've got your bonders here. Down and right and up and right to sink, then down to your start and then back around. For your red line, you go up to a flip flop, which is facing upwards, left, and then down to your grab drop, you've got your bonders. Down and right and down to grab drop, and then just keep going to your flip flop, which is facing right. Down and right to a flip flop, which is facing upwards, and then go to your sinks, up to another two sinks, up to a sink, left to a sink, left and down to a sink, left for your grab drop, up and right and round, down to a grab drop, up, then you've got a circle out, and down and right to a flip flop, which is a right flip flop, then an up flip flop, then left flip flop, and you go right arrow there, left to an up flip flop, and then it just goes left and around like that. So this flip flop goes up to right, and then basically you've got a huge amount of flip flops and basically you're just going to have them going around and around and around and around like that until it eventually comes out here and then you got left flip flop going this way and then you got flip flop going up and this one goes left back towards the normal path eyes that would go around and down to this grab drop and down and right this grab drop and you got this flip flop which goes right to this flip flop which goes left so it's sort of like going back and forth and you got the sink going up to the sink and up to the sink, and then left and down to the sink, and left to this grab drop, and then back around to your giant loop of flip flops. For the last stand reactor, you start off the red line, which goes right to an A, then right to a negative bond, then down to a grab drop, then right to a grab drop, down to a drop, then an MB, then grab drop, then left to a clockwise rotation, up to a positive bond, right for your drop to a flip flop facing up, and down to a flip flop facing up, and left to a flip flop facing right, then up to a negative bond. Up to a grab drop and then back down, you got bunges here. For this flip flop, it either goes left to a positive bond or as it goes right, and you go through the flip flop to right to a grab drop, down to a fork out, down to a sink, down and left, and back up to sink and back and start. For the blue line, you go left to a sink, left to a grab drop, left to a positive bond, up and right to a grab drop, down to a fork out, down to a positive bond, left to a positive bond, left to a positive bond, left to a grab drop, down and right to a grab drop, up for your positive bond to a fork out, left to a sink and back into start. So I'll show you how the first reactor works. Basically, it does take quite a while. Basically, it's just going around in giant circles. And then you got this one, which is doing all the flip flops. Yeah, basically, it's kind of hard to show because they take forever to do a loop. <laughs>